This is T-Money. We're here at the Big E in West Springfield, Massachusetts on Saturday, September 19, 2009. What a wonderful festival. This is so much fun. There's thousands of people here. Everybody's having an absolute blast. And we have the iconic band Fog Hats playing tonight. It's going to be so much fun. Come on down. Thank you so much. Hi, this is Team Money with C News, and we're here at the Big E in West Springfield, and we're interviewing Foghat. Thank you so much, guys, for taking time to talk to me right now. Well, I'll tell you, you guys have been rock and roll icons for nearly 40 years. I mean, what's it like you know, having such a strong following, so many fans, going to so many venues, even after so long, four decades? It's amazing. It's a real honor to be able to continue to do it, mostly, you know, and, and the, the main thing is we have the most fun. That's awesome. That's awesome. After 40 years, like we're really pleased to be featured on desktops all over across the world. That's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> um, now, as musicians, you guys have traveled all over the world, and then you've toured with bands like Aerosmith and ZZ Top, and just about everybody in between. What's the most memorable moment you guys have had, either individually or collectively? Uh, <laughs> oh, individually. Well, I had an embarrassing moment once at a hotel where uh, the window was open, and I went out to the hallway uh, without any clothes on and by accident the door slammed shut on me. Oh and I, so I had to walk down to the front desk. And it was in, in Germany and I didn't speak German and I, I had to uh, uh, live through that situation. This is rather embarrassing. Do these guys ever let you live it down? <laughs> Actually no, they didn't know about it until tonight. Right? That's awesome. Um, now, um, your most recent album is 2003's Family Jewels. Is there any new Foghat music be being made? Is there a new album we should be looking for? And if so, when should we be looking to see it? Yeah, uh, we've got a DVD. We just finished a live DVD. It's coming out at the end of this year. We have a blue CD we finished coming out at the end of the year. And next year, we're starting work on a new studio record down in Florida. We'll be, uh, we have a room down there. We have a big room. Ten acres. Uh, we have we've actually had, um, yeah, we've actually had two releases since the Family Jewels album, both okay. live albums. We've have a live two, which was uh, recorded live at the Sequan Theater in uh, California. So that's a double live album, and uh, we just released a uh, live in the studio. Um, live at the Blues Warehouse, which is a radio show on Long Island, so that was recorded direct to disc, no overdubs, you know, straight to uh, two track. Now, how many more uh, tour dates do you have planned on this particular tour? Because we're at the Biggie in West Springfield right now. How many more dates on this particular tour? Day 20. Day 20, that's great. That's great. And, um... Is there anything else you want to say to our viewers before we go? Yeah, Sea News rocks. <laughs> I was just going to say that. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, rocks. thank you so much, guys, for taking time to talk to us. A pleasure. And pleasure. Um, this is Team Money with Sea News, and we'll see you soon. See you soon. Bye bye. Sea News rocks. Sea News rocks.